Hello, here I am with another video. This is a collection that came into the shop and uh, I picked it up for a pretty good price. It just goes to show you that uh, these old books are out there. You just have to, uh, I don't know, be there when they come around. Uh, the collection started looking like this and uh, I started to bag and board it and then my friend David, AKA Garage Geek, he said I should do a video. So I'm doing this really quick. And uh, check out these comics. Action. They're not, you know, these are well-loved comics. They're not meant by any condition, by any stretch of the imagination but still I was glad to pick them up because I know the customers in my shop will eat them up put a you know I put reasonable prices on them and they'll go because you just don't see these old books anymore not like the old days when they were a dime a dozen Check this out. It's from 1962. The old hand coming out of the void. And the great clay face, clay face Joker feud. Another classic. Some of these giants are in really nice shape. Yeah, he brought these in in a plastic tub. <laughs> and uh, I started digging into it and I was like, wow, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. This was beautiful condition. Riddler. Ernie Chan art. This one's kind of tattered, but still it's a cool book. This is interesting. This is the very first time Neil Adams drew Batman, at least not a cover, and maybe the first time ever, uh, it's uh, it just inked over Carmen Infantino's pencils. But you can see, you know, those little Neil Adams, uh, uh, I don't know what you call them, splashes. It's a very cool book. I think that's a Neil Adams cover. And that's a nice Mac, Mike Kaluta cover. That's as far as I got them bagged and boarded. This other batch, I'm gonna have to be a little more ginger on handling them. This is a, a Whitman Batman. Two-Face. Batman in bondage. Where's Batman? And 
This is a nice Paul Glacy cover. What an artist. Is that Mike Zek? Yeah. Ten Nights in the Beast of the Beast. Very dynamic. There's a Batman annual. So always fun. And Batman family. Brave and the Bold, Batman and the Joker. Stay back. Nobody lays a hand on my father while I'm around. My partner, oh, my partner while I'm around. Duh. And Batman and Wildcat and the Joker. And Batman and Wonder Woman. Check out this old detective. Picked that up for $3 back in the day. Not sure, but I think it's worth a lot more than that. I've got to try and grab that killer before he sends that Moby Dick whale at us again. Oh no, Batman. And there's a badass Cooper cover on Detective Comics. Nice. And there's another Kaluta. Not sure about that. Could be a Paro, maybe. Don't hold me to that. That looks like an Ernie Chan. And good old Dick Giordano. The Rogues Gallery. And what's this new bird book doing here? From uh, May 89. That's a, if you can call that a newer book. I think that's the newest book in the collection. And Joker. It's in pretty nice shape. The Scarecrow. And then that's the end of the Batmans. But there's some Superboys. Kind of beat up and well loved. There's a Neil Adams cover. Superboy falling to earth. Another Neil Adams. Red or black, you must pick or die. Superboy number one. Happy 16th birthday. New Adventures of Superboy. And here's a DC Super Giant with Supergirl. And a regular old issue of Supergirl with the snakes in her hair, Medusa style. Cool. And a few old Supermans. And if you're just going to have a few old Supermans, you might as well have this one. Look at that bad boy. Kryptonite Nevermore. Both Superman. Nice. Page giant. Those are fun. And here's Whitman, 
Superman. Lana, now do you believe I'm Clark, Clark Kent? No, this is what Clark Kent looks like. Oh, that's weird. And another Whitman Superman. So a little tough to find. I'd say it was a newsstand, but these are all newsstand back in this era. Sorry, about to drop the camera. My old hands are getting a little bit arthritic. There's no escape, Superman. I'm shrinking you down to nothing. Great Krypton, Supergirl's gone power mad. <laughs> Must be in politics. There's a nice Gil Kane cover. And here's one from 1985. Revealed at last, Supergirl's secret marriage. <laughs> this is badass. Lewis becomes a bionic girl. Superman families, they're goofy. What is that? Supergirl turns fairy godmother. <laughs> and another Superman family giant. And a little lonely Jimmy Olsen. And a couple of Lois Lanes. Including this classic cover. I think that's Neil Adams. Might be mistaken. I think it's Neil Adams. Tearing down the girlfriend off the cover. That's so cool. And a few world's finest. That's Neil Adams. Look at that. World's finest giant. Nice. John Jones bringing it to Superman. Look at that monster. World without men. the last world's finest and there was just some oddball stuff Superman's Krypton Chronicles number one it's kind of beat up you know these comics were well loved you can tell the owner read the heck out of them DC Special War of the Giants And a little lonely witching hour. And just to show he didn't only buy DCs, here's a Whitman lost in space. Well, that's it for this collection. Well, uh, if you enjoyed this video, let me know, like it, and uh, appreciate your comments. Bye.